Hello, good morning, this is Diecast Loon. I hope you're all doing well. This morning's video is going to be really quick as I'm only going to be basically showing the one piece. Um, I'm going to be showing something that my five-year-old son bought me for my birthday um, and I just wanted to basically show it. And also the fact that it's a car that I do really quite like. So there's a little hint in the background of what we're going to be taking a look at. Um, so as you can see, we've got a couple of mainline Hot Wheels Supras so we got this awesome little red one which i've had for a while now which is awesome which is based on i'd say i think it's, i think it's the series two um i think there was one before this and then this is the more uh newer up-to-date version which i'm not such a big fan of but still pretty cool so anyway we'll take a look at the one in question and it is this from mini gt so it is Toyota Supra in black. So I won't bore you with all the horrible crispy noises whilst I try and get this plastic off. So I'll just grab it off and I'll be back with you. And here it is. So that's the horrible plastic rubbish off. So let's take a look at the box very quickly. So anybody knows Mini GT, quite a plain box, but get straight to the point and what it's supposed to go on about. So you can just see part, of, obviously the picture of the car and all the license inside of it so we will get it out so just bear with me and like i said my my young boy picked this out and here it is absolutely fantastic great great looking piece a little bit of oil there or something but yeah very nicely done and this is exactly how I like it in its more standard form so and again obviously mini GT quality and there we go my camera's not enjoying the angle two seconds let's just put a let's try it like that so there you go obviously lens tail lights super on the plates Got this nice large spoiler some came with a large spoiler some didn't a lot of it depended on the engine type because a lot of the, some of these were three liter non-turbo automatics and some of these were three liter twin turbo manuals it all depended on what they were but fantastic looking piece so that is from my young son for my birthday so like I said, that is it. That is it's, today's video is quite short. I will be doing a challenge video later on this afternoon, so stay tuned for that. Nitro Speed, Mike from Nitro Speed put out the Camaro challenge. So look up Mike from Nitro Speed, give his challenge a go. Great way to get involved with the community. But anyway, stay tuned for that. And with that, I'll see you all very soon. Thanks for watching.